Okay, so yesterday I posted an IC short number 449 in which I answered a question that what do we mean by the single strength of noradrenaline infusion? So when I was going through the comments of that particular video, some of you have asked that what do we mean by the single strength of adrenaline infusion in the ICU? So again, simply if we simplify it, generally the usually the adrenaline ampule comes in a strength of 1 ml which is equivalent to 1 mg of adrenaline that's all no confusion 1 ml of adrenaline uh, ampule equals to 1 mg of adrenaline so by single strength what one will feel that or what one will assume that 1 ml of adrenaline or 1 mg of adrenaline in 50 ml of the infusion syringe and this is the single strength adrenaline so that's what uh, generally one will one would assume but when you go globally and when you go through the literature and what go to the local guidelines, most of them, uh, what they say, this is not correct. What they say is single strength adrenaline infusion equals to 3 ml of adrenaline, means 3 mg of adrenaline in 50 ml of uh, dextrose syringe. But to be technical, it's 3 ml into 47 ml of dextrose, like that. Now, why, we, why they call it a single strength and what is the logic behind it? So understand that. 3 mg in 50 ml of dextrose equivalent to 3000 microgram in 50 ml of dextrose. When we convert 1 mg into a microgram, we multiply it by 1000. So 3000 microgram in 50 ml of dextrose. Now, then how 1 ml will contain? So uh, 3000 divided by 50 equals to 60 microgram in 1 ml of that infusion serine. Now, when we start this infusion at 1 ml per hour like that, so this 1 ml will go, this 60 micrograms will go in uh, 60 minutes. So in one minute, how much it will go? 60 divided by 60 microgram divided by 60 minutes. So it will go to one microgram per minute. So if you make a single strength uh, adrenaline infusion, which means 3 mg of adrenaline in 50 ml of dextrose, what you will get, what you are getting is one microgram of adrenaline going per minute into the patient. And this helps to adjust the dose very easily. So that's that's what about single strength adrenaline infusion 3 ml or 3 mg of adrenaline in 50 ml of dextrose to give one microgram per minute the dose uh, to which we can adjust very easily uh, from patient to patient so thank you for asking and we all should read more about it thank you